Just injury update of uh, Koi Kronk. Uh, unfortunately, um, as many of you saw during the game, experienced a lower leg injury that was, that was serious. And so he'll be having surgery this week and he'll be out for the season. And uh, um, not career ending, so he'll be, he'll be, he'll bounce back. But uh, um, just, uh, you know, tough break for him. And uh, love that guy. Just everything he brings to our program and has brought to our program. And uh, one of our captains, one of our leaders. So as you saw, the guys rallied around him. Um, and you can just tell by the way the team responded in an impromptu way to him on the field. But I thought it was, it was pretty awesome. So I get out there and he grabs me. He's like, and I was as you're I'm just checking on him. He's like, Coach, it's, it's way too far from my heart to kill me. It's the first thing he said. And then the second thing he said, and he's like, Coach, man, we, it's a big one. We got to win this game. Make sure these guys finish. And, and it could have happened like, you know, early in the game. So all I cared about was uh, his teammates and his team and us getting the win. And he knows. Uh, What's at, what's at stake each and every week. So, great passion from him for our program, and uh, just a lot of respect for for Coy and uh, all he's given to Indiana. So, just uh, prayers for him and his family as he goes through getting this thing squared away. And, and uh, adversity makes all of us better, and uh, so he'll benefit from this in the long term, and and we'll be with him. And then uh, at quarterback, uh, will be a game time decision for uh, for that position. I'm really pleased with Peyton's play and the way he's led and continues to do a great job. And so Michael's been rehabbing, and that's uh, continued to go to go well. And we'll find out more here uh, throughout the week and then make a decision uh, for that position um, on game day.